Okay, so hi, Xmir. Welcome back to another video. Mr. Paytas is going absolutely berserk. Um, I have to follow her on Twitter to see what she's posting. Hopefully, I get accepted. If not, I'll find another way to look at her tweets. So I'm gonna look at a pop a gut video here. Um, he shows the videos and whatnot. I'm gonna be skipping around, and yeah. So let's get right into it. I mean, not for nothing, but like you have done a lot of fucked up things. Just because someone says stop talking about me doesn't mean that you have to stop. But I mean, come on, you you you, you got called out for a false accusation, Trisha, and now you're fe this is and a lot of the hate is coming from a lot of women, especially who have very serious trauma. Um, by the way, I'm feel like mic, Trisha's invalidated. So them. you don't hear any background noise. <laughs> And it's not because they believe in whatever. It's, they're, they're, it's, it's literally just because they have a hatred. Bro, she did, she's doing it again. So she said it's not stopping. Not because they have any belief that I'm a bad person, basically. But because they're just... I'm going to skip until she starts talking again. You know, sorry, Pavoga, but I don't. I don't really care what you have to say at the moment. <laughs> did you hear she, she tried to call him and record the call. Did you hear what she said? She tried to call him and record the call so that she could catch him saying something because usually he's really nice to her. What a what an asshole. And you want to know what? Ethan not picking up the phone is the absolute best way to go. The, her 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 current meltdown has no responsibility on Ethan at all. These, uh, why would you pick up the phone? This is a person that like tried to legitimately ruin Ethan's life. Why would he pick up the phone? Why? Why, why would he pick up the phone? Why would you ever do that? You have to know the fucking distress that I'm in. And you know what they're going to do? A They'll make a whole video about this, put their ads in. Their yep. The, oh, yeah, probably. Sponsors. For what? Let's look at that. She's like, I'm making a video melting down, and I know they're going to cover it. Oh, my God. You so ugly, you look like an extraterrestrial from the Milky Way galaxy. God motherfucking dead. They think they control and monitor. Shh, they do. First of all, they've actually removed like everything about me and Moses for the most part. So yeah, as you can tell, she's literally having like a tantrum like a four-year-old kid. And she's like, you know, like 34 or something. It really is like the dumbest looking thing ever. Uh, I'm going to skip farther because he keeps talking and whatnot. And I'm just trying to see the clips, and I can't because of Twitter issues. What happened? What, what? You know what I mean? Like what? What happens? Like, do we care if what happens? You know what I mean? Um, okay, so here's Trisha. This is what she posted. First of all, Trisha, you, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to charge your damn phone, girl. Okay, what the hell are you doing? Anyway, she did it with Dan from H3, Ethan, Ela. I guess the last name's there. I'm begging and pleasuring for the last. <laughs> I'm sorry for laughing. This motherfucker goes, I'm begging and pleasuring for the last time. <laughs> I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. My camera got a little funky here. Hold on. All right. I'm begging and pleasuring for the, <laughs> for the last time to never mention me in passing again. Moses is now being falsely accused of, you know, the R word. I was molested as a child and the family has no idea. Okay. We already talked about this. Is that like you said he molested you and got arrested for CP. That was the objective falsehood. So it's hard to believe you, uh, you actually got molested. So look at those serious C videos. Look up Mysterious on YouTube. Watch the Trisha Paytas ones, part one and two. It's worth it. Or go to my channel and watch my reactions. <laughs> if I've talked with his family. They are unaware of the report I made as a child. They want it to go away. So just make us aware of the report. If he's such a bad guy, why are you protecting him? If this guy really did molest you, then like let's spit on his grave. Show us. Show us the report. Oh my God, start taking responsibilities for your own actions and stop blaming us for everything that's happening to you. And same for Moses, who is not in this chat, but I'm sure he is reading. Jesus! That was from Ela. Fucking, check it out. That was fucking intense. Dude, Ela's such a, that's a fucking baller move. <laughs> Holy shit, she fucking destroyed her. That was E. that was Ela. So yeah, so this video is not, you know, very long. Um, all in all, Trisha is the dumbest person on the internet. Playing victim in all situations she can, dragging everybody down with her. This situation is getting wild. Um, there's going to be a lot more probably to come out of the situation. So you're probably going to see a, 
a decent amount of videos this this week and f over the next couple weeks. I already had a video recording it, recorded about what happened and some of the situation, but like it really snowballed into something else earlier today or yesterday or whenever. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed, like, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.